Welcome to Newsmakers. My name is Sean Smith. I'm the Assistant Director of Community Relations for Cheshire County Public Schools. Join us today, Lori Donovan. Welcome to you, Lori. Thank you. It's great to have you with us. Uh, Lori, you are the Instructional Specialist for Library Services, and uh, we're taping in, in May, but we want to talk about some exciting things that are happening this summer. A lot of ground to cover in a few short minutes here, but let's talk first of all about a, an exciting new program, the Elementary Summer Learning Program, and really this year have an NFL team that's involved, the Washington Redskins. Tell us about that, that, that program and what does Redskins read, if you would? We're very excited to be partnering with the Redskins now that they have moved their training camp to the Richmond area. One of their components is a community outreach and this program is one to get some incentivized reading program. We know that educational losses up to two months can happen if students are not actively engaged in summer learning. And here's a wonderful way to promote reading with a local celebrity base that we now have with the Washington Redskins. So students from um, pre-kindergarten up through rising fifth graders can participate in this program. And we are working also with the Chesterfield County Public Library to help log them, um, their minutes. So they go online and register as a Chesterfield County Elementary School student and there they log their minutes. Their goal is 1,000 minutes because every 10 minutes equals one yard. Right. So the more yards they get, the more. So they could earn a possibility of 10 touchdowns if they complete the challenge. Um, the Redskins will have prizes for the student who reads the most in each school, for the class that reads the most in each school, and the school with the most minutes read will have a Redskins player come and do a Redskins reading rally oh, wow. in September and come to their school. And it's open to all the Cowboys fans too, right? <laughs> Any NFL uh, fan can participate. The point is we want to get our kids reading and um, not experience that summer slide right. that can occur. Well, that's very exciting. And obviously, from the elementary perspective, that's going to uh, yield a lot of benefits to it. Let's talk about the, the secondary summer reading program. And how did the secondary students become involved in summer reading programs? There is still a summer reading program for secondary students. So our rising sixth graders through 12th graders can participate through the public library. They have um, a read-on program. And if they log their minutes uh, weekly, they get registered uh, to win a free book. If they complete the 1,000 minute reading challenge, their name goes into a drawing for um, a grand prize of an iPad mini. Wow. So we're encouraging all students to read no matter what grade level. Right. And as you think about obviously the summer reading programs, one of the other big uh, aspects to it for this year obviously is the, the summer SOL and summer resources site. Um, tell us about what that site is and who it's for. The site is for um, teachers, students, parents, anyone who wants to um, keep going with some fun, interactive activities to help promote um, core subject areas as well as uh, language, uh, uh, world language. So um, there are interactive sites, there's parent links for um, help, for resources for them in addition to. We hope this will become a resource that teachers will use throughout the year, not just summer, but just a place, one-stop shop for where parents, teachers, students can go and have some fun learning this summer. And as you think about it, we have about 45 seconds left. Uh, obviously, the focus is providing the resources to the, to the parents, to the students. What really has been the response? Obviously, it's during their summertime, but what's the response obviously, when they come back to school? It's got to be good for the teachers, too, and obviously for families as well. What, what, what do parents usually think about some of these programs we put in place? The, the response that we had at the CCPS line at the library has been very positive. So we've had lots of parents sign up for the summer reading program. We also demoed the site at all of the branches and we got very positive feedback from, oh, this is really great. I'm glad this is here. Right. So as we get this out more and present it to the school board and, and um, put it on it's on the website the CCPS right. website that more parents will see it as an opportunity to help their children um, succeed at home as well as in school. Well some very exciting programs we appreciate you being here so we can learn more about it and we encourage obviously all the families to to check out some of these programs somewhere just around the corner. Yes thank you very much for having me. Thanks again and thanks to our viewers please join us next time to learn about Cheshire County Public Schools.